Invisible's technology is a way of adding interactivity to uh, different things that uh, we deal with every day. We make these special inks that we can print on different types of uh, objects and materials and they can actually change color and they change color with an electric charge so whenever we apply a simple very low power uh, electric charge on that ink that we print uh, it will change color and this um, can actually be used to different types of interactivity to uh, everyday everyday objects and things like uh, touching a surface and making it change a color or moving something and have some kind of uh, animated uh, effect appear also on that surface. So this is what we do at Invisible. My dream started in 2000 and uh, it comes from the University of Lisbon. Actually we had a laboratory of multimedia and virtual reality uh, back in the 90s that was very successful internationally and uh, some of us went to the US. I was a visiting professor at MIT from 98-99 and there we realized that we should go to the market with our technologies. We had a challenge uh, from a major uh, Portuguese football coach. Uh, he wanted to do pro uh, image processing of the uh, players in the football field. And everything is very confusing, especially when uh, there are penalty kicks. It's very difficult to do image processing. So we imagined that with the invisible links and with the infrared camera, we could, f we could improve the image processing. And then we start thinking, well, these invisible links can become visible. Uh, through electrochromism and other uh, chemical mechanisms and so we decided, well, let's go that way. Uh, football is very interesting and we are still working with it, but uh, we can open a new industry doing uh, electrochromic scre uh, screens in almost every possible surface, from clothing to paper, plastic and so forth. So we went on to do research and that research ultimately led to Invisible. Well, Invisible, on the other hand, is a technology that is very low cost and it can be applied to, to even disposable products such as magazines or packaging or, you know, just uh, postcards and that kind of application. So uh, the difference between Y Dreams and, and Invisible, I think, is in terms of the application. Invisible allows for uh, very low cost applications and it allows for us to include interactivity and animation to objects that are usually just static. Invisible is very important because it has a, a lower energy requirements and lower environmental impacts in the end than the traditional elect electronic industry. Of course, the future, we believe that it is of a world where everything is interactive, where every, every object is intelligent, and that is the vision that is guiding both Wide Dreams and Invisible through different technologies. The lab is a place where knowledge is created. It's also where the main uh, scientific developments happen and, and therefore it's where the patents that Invisible can explore as its uh, intellectual property also are created. We are, uh, of course, focusing on our display technology, but we are going to integrate also the electronics and power supply components that are needed uh, for the displays to work and to be uh, interesting and easily integrated into the final products of our clients. We have a strong multidisciplinary team that's also organized in order to fulfill these objectives of the company. And so we think our uh, structure is very well uh, organized in order to meet uh, this target. We've also, in terms of future developments, are um, keeping a very important uh, partnership with the university. And of course, that gives us uh, the possibility to explore new technologies and deliver future generations of Invisible's technology to the market uh, in the years to come. Invisible stands for interactivity, creativity, future, vision, and innovation. We are looking for um, ways to scale up our technology, therefore our daily routine bases on international and global contacts all over the world. 
We have suppliers from USA, China and other countries and also clients worldwide. This is pretty much what we see as the future of this technology or other technologies that Invisible may uh, explore and develop in the future. We do see an interactive world uh, around us and uh, we keep our, um, our mission or our vision um, as being the main uh, target uh, for the developments that we are currently and undertaking and also in the future.